a little bit more? Um, well, I started taking classical piano lessons, and then as soon as I hit my preteen, my awkward preteen years, <laughs> um, I discovered Nirvana and mm. blues mm -hmm. and um, R&B and Motown, and I oh yeah fell in love with that. I was about sick of classical, yeah. so <laughs> I was just like, if I'm gonna play music, it's gonna be that music that I like. Yeah. And then the music I write. So yeah. Where, where do you get your inspiration to, to write your music? Being adopted mm -hmm. and growing up in Minnesota for sure. And somewhere high above the clouds, yeah. unseen, I, I can attribute it to that. Mm -hmm. I like yeah. that. Now I gotta ask, I mean, your fashion is on yeah. point. You too, <laughs> with the purple it. rain yeah. shirt and those pants. Me I mean, like, yeah. so I, do you guys have a stylist or is this all you? <laughs> this is all us. No yes. way. You are your yeah. own what? stylist. Mm -hmm. I love it. I was gonna, I crossed my fingers hoping that uh, I would look okay today. Hey, I'm all <laughs> about great. it. Yeah, yeah. guys actually great. about all the hats too. He does have his hat that he typically kind of wears Miho on so, some days. Oh, yeah. Usually in the winter or fall. Yeah, yeah. Usually in the fall winter. Yeah. It's too hot for a hat, yeah. right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so you're gonna play a couple songs for us right now. Um, yep. What's the first one? I think we're gonna do uh, the ladder. Perfect. Okay. okay. The ladder. Let's get Let it. Let me take it away. All Come right. join you after. I get it, y'all. Maida, can you talk a little bit about mm. the kind of music you play? I feel like there's a wide range, but um, this is obviously more of an acoustic sound this morning, but you mm -hmm. do play different kinds of music. Right. I, pl I play with a band. Mm -hmm. 
it's more upbeat, funky, <laughs> rock and dance. Sure. Um, aggressive. <laughs> uh, and this is more soulful mm -hmm. and definitely more kind of an intimate, introspective feel. Do you have any specifics of, or any like particular way you lean in terms of what kind of music you like to put out there? Um, I like to put out relatable music, mm -hmm. but I also like to put out interesting and different because that's who I am. And uh, there's a lot of sort of read between the lines. Mm. And I like to use symbols and metaphors and stuff like that and humor for sure. Yeah. And also I've noticed, let me come up here a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah. You have such a wide range. Mm -hmm. You know how you came in super chill, super mellow very beautiful voice and then earlier in the show you were rocking out yeah. how do you write such a, a, a wide range how do you get yourself mentally in that all right now it's time for me to rock out or now it's time <laughs> for me to kind of you know be mm -hmm. chill um it's definitely uh driven by my message and i mean life isn't uh, isn't just like cruise control for mm -hmm. sure right. um and I'm, I'm a storyteller and I like, it's not just about, you know, singing my emotions and showing you I can play guitar. It's about telling you a story. And I just feel animated. It's more of a performance, more of a conversation. Like, you know, when it's live, it's like I'm talking to you mm -hmm. or with you. Mm -hmm. So. I'm not just gonna sit here and talk, you know, monotone right. to you, but if I'm excited, I'm gonna show you I'm excited. Mm -hmm. If I'm mm -hmm. sad, I'm gonna show you I'm sad. So. Yeah. I like yeah. that, yeah. I really like the song Dragonfly. That, that's the title, right? Dragonfly? Yeah. yeah. What yeah. is that about? That is about being torn by, for example, like a profession and family, mm. or, mm. you know, two loves and trying to prioritize that and see how you, you can take within yourself your truth and make that decision, make the choice, or balance it in the best way. And you know, when you do, you f it's beautiful. Yeah. It, you feel it's beautiful inside. So yeah. like kind of letting your inner dragon fly out. I you love that relate to that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I love that. Okay, what's your next song for us? I think it'll be Dragonfly. Yeah. Hey, thank you. Get out of your way. Yeah. I'm a Dragonfly on out of your way, too. <laughs> Go find your Dragonfly, guys. <laughs>
How fun! Okay, one last question for you. Where can people find your music if they wanted to check you out? Yep. Where do you go? Well, YouTube, um, Maida Miller, you'll find it all there. <laughs> um, CD Baby, Bandcamp, dot Maida. I think it's Maida. <laughs> I made a song, maybe? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> cool. And um, yeah, Facebook and all the platforms. Okay. So. Wonderful. Well, Maida, thank you so much for being here. Thanks oh, for bringing thank Miho you. with us. Thank you, guys. Thank so you. We loved it. Beautiful. Guy and Jen, they loved it, too. Thank you. Thanks we for checking it, it out. <laughs> of course, head to care11.com slash sunrise for much more on this performance, and we'll link you to Maida's stuff.